final round of the FedEx St. Jude Classic from TPC Southland in Memphis, Tennessee. Two players tied at the top, Andrew Putnam and Dustin Johnson to start the day. Putnam losing shots early, but bouncing back with a birdie at the seventh. That would get him back to 13 under par. Ches Reavy, eight under as he works the 12th from the top half of the green. Downhill falling putt, and he makes that one from 30 feet away to get to nine under. Also at 12, Dustin Johnson, co-leader at the 54-hole mark, a key par-saving putt downhill at the par four. Brant Snedeker, one hole further along. This at 13. How about that? Snedeker holding it from 69 feet away as he jumps to eight under par. Back to our leader, Dustin Johnson, 15 under, working 13. DJ from 95 yards. Pulls it back just a couple of feet from the cup, and he makes that getting to 16 under. Stewart Sink looking for one of his best finishes of the season. In the fairway at 16, his second at the par five, 216 yards. And Stewart Sink would set up an eagle, which he would make jumping back to 10 under. Dustin Johnson, look at this tight spot. Out of the tree line, up the right side of the par five 16th, look like an impossible position from 261 yards he routes it right through the trees leaves it below the hole from there a nice little pitch up and the birdie for dj this takes him to 17 under par leading by a comfortable four shots but not done how about one more highlight Johnson in the fairway at 18, 169 yards to a pin, cut to the front, and the victory already in hand, but he adds another stylish shot to finish, a hole-out eagle for Dustin Johnson with the roars around 18, signaling the victory. Win number 18 of his career with a 19 underscore second victory of the season as he moves to second in the FedEx Cup standings. We look ahead in a couple of weeks to the Travelers Championship opening round coverage on Thursday, beginning early at 7 a.m. Eastern with your PGA Tour Live app.